Hey, what's going on guys? It's ETA Prime back here again. Today I'm back with the Xiaomi Mi Box and I want to test out some video playback. We're going to do a few 1080p videos and a few 4K videos. I'm going to be using Kodi and I'm also running these videos from a USB 3.0 Corsair 60 gigabyte SSD. So here's the deal. I'm not a video format aficionado. I don't know much about video formats. I watch Family Guy on Netflix and it looks perfectly fine to me. I don't watch many movies or TV, so, but I can tell the difference between like 1080p and 4K or 30 frames a second and 60 frames a second. If you guys know of a spot where I can download legal video test files in different formats, let me know and I can test any format you want. The problem is I've been doing research and there's so many different formats of video, I don't know what is what. But first up here, I know I can use Big Buck Bunny on YouTube with no troubles at all. This is 1080p 60fps MP4. Very, very smooth playback. So we're definitely at 60fps. You can tell by the movement. What I did was I went through and I tested all of these videos on the Xiaomi Mi Box and then I went to my Nvidia Shield TV and tested them and I gotta tell you that Nvidia Shield blows this thing out of the water. Obviously it's $130 more and it's way more powerful. So this is 1080p MP4 60 FPS. All right, so you shouldn't have any trouble playing these types of videos. Let's try a 4K 60 FPS MP4. I'm recording at 1080p 60 FPS, 30 bits a second, but YouTube's going to downgrade it. And as you can see, it's already stuttering. We are not running at 60 FPS 4K. This is just a simple MP4 file also. And we got some stuttering and some video artifacts. It's just slow video playback here. And the artifacts and distortion in this video are not from my game capture. So yeah, that sucks. Next up, I found these jellyfish test videos. Now this is 110 megabits a second, HD, H264.mkv. See if it'll play this. Looks pretty good. The quality's there, and the frame rate seems to be steady. All right, next up we have a 110 megabits a second HD HEVC dot MKV. Let's see if it'll run this one. Slow down, stuttering, skipping around you see. This is not from my SSD because when I use this on my NVIDIA Shield with the same setup using Kodi, the same USB 3.0 SSD, these videos play perfectly.
Here's a 250 megabits a second 4K UHD H264.NKV. I do notice a little bit of stuttering here and there. And finally, a 400 megabits per second, 4K UHD HEVC 10-bit.mkv. I have no freaking clue what that means, but I think this is going to be hard to run. Very, very slow playback. So that ran like crap. What I want to do now is play the Big Buck Bunny 4K 60fps MP4 side by side with the Nvidia Shield running the same video from the same exact hard drive. On the left is the Xiaomi Mi Box and on the right is the Nvidia Shield TV. As you can see, the NVIDIA Shield TV is playing at 60 FPS. It looks beautiful, very smooth, very fluid. With no stuttering or any skipping at all. We're going to do one more side-by-side -side test, and that's going to be this Jellyfish 400 megabits a second 4K UHD HEVC 10-bit.mkv. So on the left is the Xiaomi Mi Box, and on the right is the NVIDIA Shield TV. And there you have it, guys. I mean, obviously, the NVIDIA Shield TV is $130 more than the Xiaomi Mi Box. I was able to pick one of these up early from Walmart for $69.99.
my NVIDIA Shield TV was $199. It does come with 16 gigabytes of storage and a game controller. In my opinion, this is the best Android TV box to get. I know it's more expensive, but you'll be super happy with the gameplay performance and the video playback performance. I appreciate you guys watching. Like I said at the beginning of this video, I don't know much about video formats or codecs or anything like that. If you have a website that I can get test video, 4K test video, any format you want to see, let me know in the comments below or send me a private message. I'll try my hardest to get a video made for you guys. And like always, thanks for watching.